and we're back. It tasted like tears. Welcome back, guys, to another episode where we're going to be trying to figure out what the frick the rest of this game is. Tears. Santa was hungry, so she had to eat Rudolph. Santa was starving to the point where if she didn't eat her beloved Rudolph, she would have perished. How did it get like to this? Since all the kids who received my love went... I hate that voice somewhat because I'm trying to read you guys. Well, since all the kids who received my loan went bankrupt, I'm also broke. Uh, okay. Rudolph. Rudolph. I don't know if this is meant to be creepy, but this is just getting creepier by the minute, by the way. It's fine. Rudolph isn't inside me now. We'll be together forever. How is Santa meant to get around without Rudolph? What else? Santa walks. You walk? I know Rudolph was able to fly, but just because I ate him, it doesn't mean I can fly now. Not even if I paint my nose red. We decided to have a moment of silence for Rudolph. My moment of silence is wishing she had a moment of silence so I could talk. What do you plan to do once the 24th and 25th is over? I'm going to make more hopes and dreams for the next 363 days, and with those, I'm going to distribute them all on the 24th and 25th. Santa is great. I see, Santa is great. I've fallen on hard times with the factory, though, so the factory's now a pile of debris. <laughs> the factory of hopes and dreams. Why? Because logic. Because the children who borrowed the hopes and dreams from us all filed for bankruptcy altogether. Ugh. Gimme! Gimme! Hey, sorry. I don't have anything. Well, this is... This is enlightening, I'm gonna be honest. Sorry, I had to do something there for just a quick second. I had to fix something. The morning went by and it's now noon. Uh, afternoon. Want to see snow, white snow. A white panoramic landscape. I want to see a beautiful white scenery. Go away, son. Let the snow fall. I'm hungry. Santa was starving. You're hungry. Sure, why not? <laughs> Rudolph, you're alive? I have ramen if you want. I don't like instant food. We can always starve. You bad debtor. The creditor forced violence on the debtor. A knuckle to my forehead. A minute of recovery. I passed out. A minute passed. Rebirth. That's a relief. Hey, I wouldn't die from that. Impossible things. What? Okay, are you just wanting me to... I... Apparently I owe... Anime Girl Santa Claus here. Hopes and dreams. She likes to punch me out. And she's pressing me like she's a freaking um, uh, loan officer. Fantastic day. I can't afford to be careless on this fantastic day. Santa? What? Why did you start lending hopes and dreams to kids? Well, I was selling them at first. Yeah, yeah, you kids, you know, hopes and dreams. Yep. For how much? Despair. You know, this is getting out of hand. <laughs> You're nuts. Despair? If you sell your despair to us, we'll give you hope. How does that work as a business? I don't know why or how, but it was sure popular. 
then at some point humans stopped selling it to us. They said they could have couldn't give it to us even if they wanted to. What do you mean? They hold on to it like a treasure, but scream for help to separate it from them. Aha. Okay. That's why we started loaning the hopes and dreams to them. Why'd they lend it to them when you could just as easily have given them away? They tend to be thrown away if we give it to them for free. Uh, you threw it away too, you debtor. Oh goodness. Did she punch me again? This is the most violent Santa Claus I've ever seen. <laughs> what the frick? For playful jest, it was unexpectedly strong that I nearly fell over. Anyway, so since you, they were throwing them away, if you just give it to them, you start loaning them out instead. Yep. I plan to have them return with a lot of interest. Okay. Yeah. But everyone went bankrupt. This game is deep. Okay, lady. Just, just please stop doing that. Please stop doing that. You don't understand that I got nothing. I told you this 500 times. <clears throat> it was now late in the afternoon and the sun had returned home. I gave Santa a cup of water. What was it? Please stop. Please stop. You are so, so stupid and annoying. Oh, Rudolph, you don't have to... You don't plan on being picky with what you eat in your current status, are you? Santa? Yes? What do you plan to do from now on, Santa? Since this whole thing about lending isn't working out, shouldn't you try something else? Hmm. Can you try and come up with a plan? We decided to contemplate for a moment. Stop being a batshit crazy lady, how about that? That's, that's, that's part one. I don't know. Just when I thought this Lone Shark idea was good and original when I came up with it. You sure you weren't just being greedy? You know, with the interest and all, it's a bit... Oh my goodness. What the frick? She's getting so mad! <laughs> Ten years ago, you definitely pinky promised that you would pay it back to me a hundred times. No, a thousand times. We even went as far as spit shaking on it. This Santa. No matter how I looked at it, there's no denying that she had a deeply rooted sense of resentment. Sorry, I lost it all, so I have nothing left. She's. I wanted to say she was adorable in the beginning of this, but this is freaking creepy, man. You could almost visually see Santa's heart sinking. Seriously, what am I supposed to do now? For the first time, Santa is showing some true sense of anxiety. Santa, we've wasted a day. Christmas Eve is almost over. Uh huh. Oh, there we go, it's gone. It's Christmas Day now. What the frick? <laughs> this, is, this is actually kind of disturbing and not funny at all. Christmas Day arrived without a slightest show of mercy. Looking outside of the window, I could see the snow dancing in the wind. Yay, it's snowing. It was snowing quite heavily. I wonder if I could see a sea of white when I open my eyes tomorrow. Santa, do you want to stay up all night? No, kids need to sleep early. I'm an adult now. Nope. Just like how my mind is still Santa. You... Shut up, I'm trying to read. God. This, this game is stupid with that. 
how does it expect you to read this sufficiently if she if you got an anime girl chatting in your ear? Just how my mind is still saying even though I'm wearing a school uniform, your mind is still that of a child even though you appear like an adult on the outside. Mind? Appearances don't really matter. What's important to you is the way you feel in your heart. My heart is always Santa. Good night. Santa pulled the blanket over herself and laid down on the bed. Followed suit. And now I'm in bed with Santa Claus. <laughs>